20 years ago, we had an idea for a wireless backup camera. The concept was simple. Connect the camera to the power, connect the monitor to the power, fire it up, and you're good to go. And oh yeah, it had to be affordable. Well, that philosophy has guided us to create some of the most affordable but reliable backup cameras in the industry. One such bundle is our 70 foot range wireless RV backup camera. And today we are proud to announce some major upgrades to that system. And in this video, we're going to go over the details, we're going to unbox it, and I'm gonna tell you everything you need to know about that system. Let's get started. Welcome back to Taddy Brothers. So let's continue. The SKU number that we're discussing today is SKU90117. The concept and the components of this system is similar to other bundles we have on the website. So for example, the horse trailer version of this system is SKU90217. Same components, it only has a few other accessories to make it more compatible to be put inside of a horse trailer. But if you get a bigger monitor or a stronger, a smaller monitor, the setup is exactly the same, just the monitor size is different. The system we're discussing today is designed for RVs, campers, and trailers. And that's what you're gonna see here today. Now, the wireless camera has a wireless range of 70 feet. One of the improvements that we made is in the installation, the setup of the system. In the past, the cameras and the monitor and the transmitters all need their own power source, which made things more complicated. However, now we've simplified the process where the camera plugs into the transmitter and the transmitter plugs into the 12 volts, and then you're done. Same thing on the monitor side. The, the receiver plugs into the monitor and the monitor plugs into the 12 volt. Whether it's a constant power source or a cigarette adapter, it'll work exactly the same. When you're setting it up, the one thing you wanna ask yourself is, do we want it on all the time or only when we go in reverse? If you want it to pop on automatically when you go in reverse, you would connect it to the reverse light. However, if you want it on continuously while you're driving down the road, you'd use some kind of constant power source, like a running light. That's a really cool feature because the high resolution or the night vision on these cameras is so much better on this year's model that a lot of our customers are now gonna use it as security for their vehicle. So when you're parked, you move the monitor back into the back where you're sleeping, you could pop it on and you can see what's going on around you, which bring you, brings us to the second feature of the monitor itself, which is it can take up to two cameras. You could put a camera at the front, you could put a camera by your door. There's a lot of different things you could do with it. And then you can toggle between camera one and camera two on the screen itself. It's a really cool feature that we think is gonna make things uh, a little bit more fun or a little bit more useful for you guys. Finally, we've also made the harness thinner, so it makes it easier to thread it from wherever you wanna thread it in the front of your vehicle. And as usual, all of our monitors come with the mount that allow you to mount it from the ceiling or mount it from the dash. Also, regarding the transmitters themselves, the setup for these transmitters is the same with our high range transmitters as well. So if you feel like you wanted something with more range that'll work longer, a uh, farther per se, right? You can just upgrade to our 95 foot range or even our 125 foot range. It just depends on what your budget is and what your goals are. One final benefit of having an analog transmitter system, it allows you to have multiple monitors seeing one camera. So for example, we've had clients that want to put a monitor in the back of their trailer where they're sleeping and they still want to leave one monitor in their pickup truck. So for example, if you're putting it on the mirror, this will accommodate that. What you do is you buy an extra receiver, plug it into the monitor and you're good to go. But if you have a farm and you have three or four pickup trucks, you can put three screens, one screen on each pickup truck, have the same receiver, and then they could interchange trailers without even batting an eye. It makes things easier and significantly more convenient. Now, one final tip. When you put this system together, we always recommend you bench test everything before you install it. It'll make the installation easier, cleaner, and quicker. Trust me, we've done this for a long time and you're, it's gonna make your life a lot easier. We think it's so important that when I do the unboxing, I'm gonna end it with showing you how to bench test the system. And you're gonna see how easy it is. It's simple and to the point. 
Now, let's go over to the boxing, the unboxing. I'll show you all the components. I'll show you how they work, what they do, how they come in the box. We'll bench test everything, and then you'll see how easy it is to put this system together. Let's go over there right now. So here are all the components included with the 90117. Let me go through every single part here so that we can uh, understand what's coming in the box. Remember that if you're buying a similar system to this, like our horse trailer version, the 90217, the components are exactly the same, just the main SKU is different because it's designed for the horse trailer people. But the setup is the same. Anything with a camera, transmitter, receiver, and screen is the same type of setup. Even if you have like one of our white transmitters, the long range ones, that also would be the same type of connection that you see here. So the first component that I'm gonna go over is the seven inch screen that you see right here. It's got two channels on it, seven inch diagonal. You can swap between camera one and camera two. You could change the color of the, of the screen itself, the hue, it's got a lot of settings on it to get a really good picture. It can stay on con consistently while you're driving or pop on automatically when you go in reverse. This is the screen itself, look how thin it is. It's, it's a good product, it's solid. It works all as well with our wired systems if you have that. This is just that with a transmitter. Next up is the uh, dash mount that's included. This dash mount is meant to put on the dash, hold up the screen so you can see it. A lot of our customers mount it on the roof and point it down just because it's got so much adjustability. Right, go like this way, that way, a lot of different ways. Other people have even used a double-sided sticky tape to stick it on a windshield. I don't necessarily recommend that, but you can do that as well if you see that it says that it goes on the windshield. Otherwise, you can get the suction cup. If you wanna screw it in, it also includes screws that you can do that screw holes to make it nice in there. I've seen that done before. And again, that looks really nice when people set that up. Next up is a sun shield. This actually component, this is this not included in the bundle. It's an accessory that you can add under the monitor upgrade, but I've gotten a lot of questions of people asking me, um, do you have a sun shield or how does it look? So this is it. It's a, a shield like this, put on the monitor. There are grooves on the side of the monitor. You can see right here. This fits into that groove like that on both sides. You do it. One second here. that and you're good to go that's the sun shield version of it okay see it doesn't really affect the back of it and on the top this is the sun shield and it's easy to take off if you ever don't want it this comes in handy for a lot of our boating customers that want this for that uh, next up is the um, insert the trim this is actually included with the bundle itself for those people that have the old style systems like a uh, Jensen system or Sony, Panasonic, ADH, any of that stuff, uh, this will actually fit into the old hole. You might have to cut it, but that's what the trim is for, to make it look nice, right? It's got that lip right there. You can see it there, right? And then what you do is you put the ins you insert this thing into the, into the dash, then you take the screen, you put it in here, click it in, and you're done. And now it's gonna look nice and flush in the vehicle. No one's gonna know that it did not originally come with the vehicle itself. If you ever need to get to the cable, it's very easy. You push that button here, you pop it out like that, and you pull it out of your screen to get to your harness if you ever needed to do that, okay? That's the seven inch screen. Here is the harness that's included with it. Remember, it's got two inputs for the video, and it also has these DC plugs. If you wanna uh, power something else, you can do that as well. Next up is the camera itself. Here is the RV camera. Again, it could stay on while you're driving down the road or pop on automatically when you go in reverse. What's nice about it is the military grade night vision. That's what these LEDs are for. So it doesn't turn on like it projects light, it soaks in the light. And what's cool about it is that it's progressive. So the darker it gets outside, the more the night vision is activated. So you could be driving three hours down the road and you wouldn't even notice that you're using the night vision version uh, rather than the daytime because the transition is so seamless, be seamless between the day and the night. Here are the connections. We're gonna show you how to hook this up to the uh, transmitter in a second. Then every single one of these systems comes with a testing cable. If you wanna bench test the system, this is gonna be helpful for you. It's included with it as well. Uh, we're not gonna need this today, but it's here. 
and then we have the transmitters and receivers. We have a few different kinds. This is the 70 foot range. That's what comes with the system here. If you want to upgrade to the long range, we have those right here. Uh, that's an upgrade that goes up to 95 feet. It's a really popular upgrade. Check and see what it is. They have different sales on it at any given moment, but that's what a lot of people get an upgrade to. If they want just a little bit more extra juice, um, something that's a little bit higher quality, a little more higher end, that's what people go with. But these are the transmitters that you get with it. There's an indicator light telling you if it's on, there's the antenna, all the connection cables, and again, I'll tell you in the back if it's a receiver or a transmitter, so you're gonna know where to connect it. And lastly, the component that you get with it that we are very proud of is the manual itself. These are manuals that were designed here in America, and they're very easy to follow language. Uh, the wording on it is very easy. You have a troubleshooting guide, you have pictures showing you different scenarios of where you could set it up. We even include some QR codes for every step of the installation. So if you get stuck, you can see that. Otherwise, you can always call us at our 866 number anytime and our American-based team will gladly help you. But these manuals are included with every purchase showing you everything you need to know about these systems themselves. Um, so now let me, let me put this all together for you guys so you can see it working. Let's set up the monitor portion first. The way we're gonna do that is, I'm going to connect the sun shield, the sun shield, the um, butterfly mount to the screen itself. We're gonna go here like this. And we're gonna slide this metal uh, square into the groove that you have in the back of your screen. Like that. And we're gonna put it on that. And then you're gonna tighten it. Put a couple of, like that. And we're gonna tighten the other side of it. Right, so we tighten this one and this one here to show you that we got two of it. And then this one is just the adjustable where you want it. So there's a lot of different ways to get that perfect view. I'm gonna put that right here. And let me, I want you guys to see the screen better. So let's go like that a little bit. And here we go. Next up is the harness itself. So we're gonna take this. We're gonna look for the arrows on the monitor, on the, on the harness. Let me find that. Right here, we got that, and we're gonna connect it with the other side right here. Right here, like that, we're gonna connect it. Now it's in, and then let's connect this thing to the power. What I'm gonna use is, um, I'm gonna use a cigarette adapter, but first, let me connect the transmitter to it. So give me one second. Or I mean the receiver to the screen itself. So we're gonna take the receiver, we're gonna find the one that says receiver, 2.4 gigahertz, okay? and I'm going to plug it in like this. We're gonna connect this thing here to channel one. Look for that here, like that. And then what I'm gonna do is, because I'm using a cigarette adapter and I wanna power it from one source, we're going to twist these together, the red and the red and the black and the black, so that we can power it from that one cigarette adapter. Otherwise, you can just connect them like this and then use the, connect them to some kind of 12 volt power source in the vehicle, like a fuse or something like that. Again, in the manual, you get different um, scenarios of how you wire it, where you wire it, how it's supposed to look. So here, we got that in there. Um, it's a little nicer. Let me get the cigarette adapter. If you do need a cigarette adapter, you can find that in our accessories section of the page itself of the 90117. Let me pull that in here. You can add that into the cart. Um, most people at this point hardwire the system, but if you want that flexibility to move around, again, it is wireless. Some people want to move it from vehicle to vehicle. You can do that. For example, if you have a trailer, you can just leave the camera there and move the monitor from truck to truck. And then you would just get an extra receiver from us that will allow you to just um, be able to do that, right? So if you have, let's say, you know, two different uh, trailers or something and you want them to work, you could just connect the, you could have five monitors with all the same receivers and it doesn't matter which one connects to the pickup truck or not, right? So here is the uh, cigarette adapter. Plug it in, like that, and this thing is on, the monitor is on. Now let's do the camera side, okay? So, so here, here's the camera itself. We're going to connect the transmitter and receiver to the back of it, like this. 
And what's cool is the way this was designed is that you only need the power from one source. So as you can see here, you have the camera feeding right here into the transmitter and then the transmitter is the only point of power that you need. So we're gonna put that over here. Let me get my alligator clips for you. Let me move my camera. And now we're going to plug this in. That's one. And, oops, two. And there you go, it's an instant on, right? So imagine you pop into reverse, it automatically turns on the first time you deal with it. I mean, this is a beautiful image right here, right? It's a live image, obviously, I have a picture of a road, so you can see it there. We've got the night vision active. Uh, this is the version that has the grid lines, even though you can deactivate them if you want. But this is, this is all it takes, right? So if you got a two camera system, you would simply just add another receiver and transmitter and you're good to go. So it's not very complicated. This video with me discussing it with you took me a couple of minutes to put it all together. And, and that's, you know, without us even um, testing it or anything like that. So we just took it out of the box and made it work. Um, but uh, that's pretty much it. Let's, uh, let's move on to the next thing. See you back at the studio. So there you have it. We've done the unboxing and the bench test. I can't tell you how important it is for you to do the same. It'll give you a better understanding of how the system works and it'll make the installation quicker and cleaner. A couple of things I wanted to go over before we wrap this up. First, the camera that's included in this bundle is 100% waterproof and weatherproof. That means that it will function in the harshest of environments, first time, every time. Also, if the system is lacking a feature that you wanted, there are plenty of options on the product page that you can change and make it fit your particular needs. For example, if you wanted a wider angle view so you could see more lanes behind you, we can do that. If you wanted grid lines or enhanced night vision, there's an option for that as well. If you need help choosing, call our American-based team and they'll gladly answer any questions you might have. Also, anything you purchase from us, including this system, comes with a one year warranty. However, some people want an extended warranty or something that covers even more. For that reason, we offer a white glove service that comes in the form of a one year or two year extended protection plan. And what does that cover? Well, that covers everything. That means that if anything goes wrong with the system, even if it breaks and it's your fault, we change it for a new one, no questions asked and we eliminate any wiggle room because we say, even if it's your fault. Now, if everything we've gone over in this video doesn't convince you to buy from us, let me leave you with a few final benefits. First, when you purchase anything from us, it comes with a 30 day, 100% money back guarantee. That means that if you're not happy for any reason, if you don't like the smell of the tape we use to close the box, let us know and we'll take it back for a full refund. Also, anything purchased on TaddyBrothers.com includes our world-class one-year warranty, which is serviced right here in the USA. Finally, if the warranty or the return policy doesn't tickle your fancy, I challenge you to whip on over to TrustPilot.com. Type in Taddy Brothers and read our hundreds and hundreds of verified, that's verified, five-star reviews. And you will see how great we treat our customers. But I can't take that credit. That credit belongs to our service agents who tirelessly speak on the phone, do FaceTime, chat and email, and endlessly communicate with every customer until they get every system exactly how they want it. Their mandate is to make each customer feel like family. And I hope you give us the opportunity to do the same for you. If you have any other questions, feel free to call us anytime at 866-966-5550 and our American-based team will gladly answer any questions you might have. If you wanna speak with me, I'm always around, I'm Tamir, and it would be an honor to earn your business. From all of us here at Taddy Brothers, Thanks for watching and have a great day.